Hi guys, I'm James Hamilton from Stumpy Dumps Woodworking Journal, and some of my favorite woodworking books are almost 40 years old. For each issue of Stumpy Dumps Woodworking Journal, we try to do a book review video. Usually we review new books, but this time I want to have a look at a set of books that's almost as old as I am and tell you why you should have them in your library too. It's a three volume set called Tay Frid Teaches Woodworking. Yes, I said Tay, not Tage. That's how the Danish pronounced it evidently. Tay was born in Denmark, where he began his apprenticeship at just 13 years old, coming of age during the birth of the modern Danish furniture movement. He was a master furniture maker, skilled designer, and a lifelong teacher. But his true masterpiece, in my opinion, is this set of books. Within these three volumes is a complete course in woodworking using both hand and power tools. The first book focuses on joinery. It begins with the basics. The wood, the tools, preparing your stock, and so on. He doesn't assume you already know everything, but he doesn't talk down to you either. Before long, you're cutting your first joints, and he covers them all. There's through dovetails, half blind dovetails, full blind dovetails, mitered dovetails, finger joints, angle joints, mock finger joints, mock dovetails, half blind splines, and he's just getting started. Every sort of joint you can imagine is taught in detail, often with step-by-step -step photos. Sure, they're black and white, but they're clear and well thought out. Book two covers shaping, veneering, and finishing. You'll learn how to steam bend, how to laminate, how to turn, how to carve. He teaches how plywood is made, for goodness sakes. Seriously, it's amazing how much he fits into each volume, without glossing over anything. The finishing section is especially comprehensive. There you learn sanding, grain filling, staining, ebonizing, oiling, shellacking, lacquering, varnishing, French polishing. Volume 3 is where he takes all that information and he puts it together, building 18 of his own designs, complete with the plans and full step-by-step -step instructions. Together, these three volumes make up a complete woodworking course written by a man who pioneered woodworking education in America. They're absolutely timeless, even 40 years later, and they deserve a spot on your bookshelf. Mine are some of the original editions, which, believe it or not, you can still find for as little as 5 or 10 bucks a volume in lightly used condition on Amazon. Volume 3 is a little harder to find, the one on furniture projects, but good condition copies are still out there. I'll link to these in the notes below this video. Be warned though, whenever we do one of these book review videos, the books do tend to sell out kind of quickly, so keep that in mind. If you can't find the vintage copies, you can get them new in a box set at some places. I think Highland Woodworking has them, but they're quite a bit more expensive that way. As always, these book review videos wouldn't be possible without the support of Isotunes. They make these awesome headphones that also protect your ears from shop noise. Usually I wear the Bluetooth wireless versions, but sometimes my phone battery is a little low, so I turn off the Bluetooth to save the juice. Isotunes now makes a wired version for just that sort of situation. They sound just as good as the wireless ones, and they still provide full OSHA compliant hearing protection. You should definitely check them out at the link in the notes below this video. It's a great way to support all the free content we produce at Stumpy Nubs Woodworking Journal. See you next time.